Hello and welcome, my name is Nilaus and this is episode 70 of our Let's Play campaign of uh, Factorio. So we are a completely different place than last time. So what I did was I made this beautiful uh, thing called a railroad track. I'm, you can see at this point it, it occurred to me that, hey, I can make, I don't have to make like vertical or horizontal, I make it like uh, cross. Yeah, diagonal ones, but yeah, so I, I didn't have enough uh, grenades to clear the path for the rest. But we are now at our base, so I will just set up as aggressively as possible. First, let's, let's this also shows how big the area is and where, where we have the ones that I must be tapped extremely hard. I guess we know where this is now. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, so the last ones will be over here. That'll be just normal. Oh, I have more? I don't think so. Well, this should actually be quite enough for sure. So how the hell are we gonna do this? I'm not gonna make like an advanced one that splits into 12 and is totally balanced. I don't care if it's balanced. I just want it to be sort of like more or less balanced. What if we just do it like this? I mean, I know that I'll get more of this one. This one will get too much, but it doesn't matter. It's, it's almost okay. I'll just use these puny ones here. Actually, I think it's quite important that we get this up and running immediately. Because this is actually where um, it's always the other way. Oops, did I step in? Yeah, I did. Ah, crap, and I can't even make any more. This is bad. Um, I'm gonna make it like halfway. I think I have a kind of a solution to this. Basically just that too. These ones are just trash, so who cares if I used too much of it. Yeah, I probably didn't go on this adventure with enough uh, raw materials because I ran out of my grenades, I ran out of materials in order to create my uh, poison capsule, so it wasn't exactly uh, super professional. Could have been a lot better. Some lights. Let's see, since I have the train, I might as well try to put it up here. Wow, you took solid fuel. You took my solid fuel. That's not very gracious of you. You're gonna go to 
Right, the answer inventory is full. Go. I'll take that. And once that happens, then you will go to main coal unload until inventory is empty. That's pretty much it. This is actually looking quite good. I mean, I would assume that this one is. Oh. Let's put this down here. I should be quite lucky that I had this. Those aliens are extremely pacifistic. I think this is actually working quite okay. The density on the right hand side is, looks about the same as the density on the uh, on the left hand side. But it is also like twice as fast. So it is supposed to work exactly like this. So. Well, let's just go home. Let's see if we put on the thickness correct. And then we can enjoy the interesting detour that we have up here. Could have shared a lot of distance here. Let's in. That's Crotinium. Well, the next part I'll do. I'm not sure this is actually enough because maybe I just don't have enough steam engines to do this. Okay, you're coming in slow. Because this part, I mean, that is a full belt. And it reaches, all of it reaches up there. So, what's the issue? Yes, bit of cleanup from the Bobmonium, or was it a robot? I can't remember. But one of those locations down here. Ugh, screw it, why am I doing it like this? I have robots to do the dirty work. Then use them. I don't think I actually have Bobmonium. Is it Bobmonium or is it a robot? Okay. Really appreciate getting some some of these. There we go, four of them. I don't know if this is smart. It probably isn't. Let's <clears throat> now. I have here. I've turned this off, so we are producing. Or do we're not producing anything? Zero coal, zero oil here. Yeah, it sucks. But this one has been disconnected for sure. It's fine, these are really not using much of this. That's salt, and they don't need salt. Oh, I've moved out as an area. Right, so what are we looking at? We're looking at like half? How the hell can that be half? I don't know. Fuck it, not working. Let's do something fun instead. Delete this entire thing. And instead, we're going to make a blueprint of this one because all of this is MK2. Yep. It's the middle of the night. I can. I don't know if I can accept that I am. That I'm not getting any, but. Uh, While we wait for them to be uh, deleted, I think this is a great opportunity for me to to actually complete more of this. What? Ah, yes, don't break, of course. Preventing me from doing much. So this will be where I make my. I need to start working on this because 
tell you here that it takes a long time. How much left? Uh, a bit left. Good. Let's take a look at this one, Mile. We uh. Is there a problem with this? That should keep you busy for a while. Now here we have a lot of yellow cake. You're not really requesting anything. When you're not requesting anything, you should be requesting... What's this? Unknown key, item name, fission reactor fuel, uranium power. That's really strange. Fobo, one part, hot leg. Hot leg is the water carrying heat from the reactor core. I probably need a bit of assistance on on this part. Let's see if we can get something in. Okay. Let's see if I can figure out what the hell I need to do. I'm going to make this one. This comes from uranium hexafluoride. Uranium hexafluoride comes from yellow clay plus fluorine gas. Fluorine gas comes from fluoride. Alright, so far so good. That should probably be stored in a gas bubble. gas. I don't like that it, it's that's this close. This one will make six of fluoride here or fluoride gas there. Running a big bubble I expect. I hope that'll work. Then a request them. We'll do advanced research. Let's get a nice little light bulb in here. Hook it up to the rest. That should do the trick. How much? It's getting great. Next one. I will now make the yellow cake. The no hexafluoride. Great. Uranium hexafluoride. Point seven. That's also made. Let's request some more of these. Uh, let's get ten. Here, that one goes in. This one. Can remember if this I believe there is, but let's figure it out. Yep, there is. And you are now building stuff. How much of it? 50 fluorine gas. Okay, that's a bit. And oh it empties them. Cool. So that's just um it's just carrying it back here. Getting uraninite here. How much are we getting? We're getting five. So for each one of these, I get five. So what are we getting out of this? We are getting some hexafluoride. Let's. I think this is something where I'll. So I take this in, there are already 20 in. What does it say? 0 0.7, 0 0.7. Okay, I'll just take one of them in. This one. Ah, I only got nine. 
Well, then I will be requesting. Don't need to request this right now. However, I would like to get some more power poles. Let's make that 50. This one now returns some 0.2. What can we do with that? We can make uranium oxide pellets. Let's do that. The plugs here. We'll make these uh, depleted uranium pellets. Ah, right. Then I also need iron 200. It's frustrating when I don't have this. Okay. And this one will be just putting it into a chest here. We'll find out what we need it for later. Let's continue the evolution. You will then... This is... Okay, let's see. This is the 1.2. So the 1.2 goes in here, which will then result in a 1.7 and something else. This results in also in a 0.7. Huh. I could have just made some up. So I believe this one would be ideal to put back here. So that's empty, and now we can proceed up the chain. So we are now reaching up to a 2.2. And this will also have some junk or some of the lower with some 1.7. No, it goes 1.7 goes in. No, that's the wrong one. So let's go to 1.2. I have none of this. This one has five. How much do we need? We need 10. How do we get more? What's the problem? Yeah, I'm missing him into barrel. Ah. So put stuff in the barrel. No, that's not it. You got hundred of this 007 thing. Oh, right, it's because this one is not working. It's not draining. So now this is working. So now we have 20 of this, I have 10, 2.2. I will then go in here and get the 2.2. I'm kind of good seeing this the pattern here. This one is recycled. Back into the process. Like this. And I am now having 20 of the higher caliber. This continues until, until I don't know what, until something. Good. Maybe I should have done that like ages ago. But this one is now, that's like 3.2. I'm going to get into trouble with that one. Or maybe I just won't, exactly won't. Well, this is good, this is working. Here. I think this is, is perfectly matched. It, it's not exactly pretty. But now I have a bit of uh, uranium hexafluoride 3.2. We'll try again. I'd rather move you because this is like the most precious thing I have. Oh, yeah, especially because it's so junk. 
out of this junk. Okay. How much? I have now 3.2. I'm gonna go all the way up. Hey, why not? I have no idea if that's uh, what. How much it is? I, I assume that it's better. Oh, it's not powered. I'm gonna put to this. 3.2? You should be getting some 3.2 in. Ah, wrong one. It's actually 3.7 I should get. Which comes back in here, and then I believe the last one. This is now a 4.2 I need. Cool. And that's the last one. And the question becomes, now what? Now I have like a lot of this, 10 of this. I'm going to use that to make pellets, I believe. Or, all right, I'll use that. Okay, I'm gonna make pellets here. That goes, hmm. This one will be up here. You'll make pellets. Go. And these will be placed in. Not there. Well, yes, here. What is this? This is ugh, an alien lab. Oh, no. Tungsten? No. I'll do a multi multi thingy logistic slots inventory slots why am i not taking these trash slots huh speed cargo size and speed i'll take the speed first i do have one of these parts so i have a lot of these parts and the next level is i want a fuel assembly 4.7 uranium 235 and a bit of steel plates I need all of that and that can be assembled in yeah just just about anything let's assemble it in this one we'll make fuel rods and we'll put them in here we'll put them down here that's more discreet i will also request a bit of steel because i need apparently i need a bit of steel probably not a lot Let's put some lights on it. I mean, when I make my nuclear weapons, uh, I mean uh, energy. <coughs> Sorry, <coughs> I meant energy, of course. That's exactly why we're here. We're here to make sustainable green energy called nuclear power. Do I have some? No, I do not. 28, so that I get one of these rods. Cool. Um, now what? Well, I still have a lot of this here in Night Story. This one's just cranking away. And I still have a few of these. This one, this tank is full. I'm not going to use much of it. I'm going to use like here. 100. To make. Yeah, but I have so much here. I can't make more. Why can't I make more? Oh, it's because I can't get rid of the get rid of this one. It's too slow. Let's do it differently. And I'm gonna make this during this depleted part. Just put them in here. Wow, that's a lot of junk. And this is the problem, I believe, with nuclear power, is that you get a lot of junk.
A lot of radioactive junk. How are we doing up here? Not a single one has been created yet. I'm only having 34. Okay, I have five here. And how much do I need? I need to get up on 10. Okay, so it's basically halves every time. This one just keeps cranking away at some radioactive junk that maybe, let's see, can I use it for something while we, I can use it for uranium oxide pellets. It's pretty good. Tank them and depleted uranium nuke shell. Oh, that sounds cool. I like that. I wonder what that does. Gee, I wonder. But the problem here is, okay, this nuclear fission reactor, I can do that with just steel plates, iron pipes, basically transport, yes, but not that. What's different? That's a big one. Cable of outputting sent to melt with heat. Not all of it can be turned into electricity due to thermal efficiency in the ranking. So, of course. Um, this one is the worst one because that requires electronic logic boards. And that's exactly where we are, what we're going to make. And they also require red circuits. And then we have these things. Come on, let me just see you make one. Make one for me. That's one. Forty-eight. These are just flashing on and on, on and off. We're at forty-nine. Come on. Yes. I now have one fuel assembly. Excellent. So, we made some uh, progress this time around, so that's great. Thank you for joining, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.